Welcome to Fabulous Nails. Today we're going to be showing you a cute neon zebra and cheetah design. Your nails will look like this when finished. You will need white nail polish, a makeup sponge, neon pink, neon orange, and neon green nail polish, a Q-tip and nail polish remover, a black striper, and a clear coat. To start out, first you're going to paint two thin base coats of white. When you're done with the two thin base coats of white, then you will pull out a makeup sponge used to sponge makeup on. Once you get the sponge, you will take a pink and make a thin stripe onto the sponge with the pink nail polish. Make sure it's a thick pink stripe so the polish will be easier to go on. After you keep brushing the pink on to make it thick, when you're done with that, the next layer you're going to make is orange. Then you will get out your orange nail polish and then you will make a stripe on it. So once you get out the orange nail polish, make another thin stripe right next to the pink nail polish. Make sure this stripe has a lot of coat so it's easier to go on your white base coat. Make sure that it's really thick. When you're done, you'll have a pink and an orange stripe right next to each other on your makeup sponge. Then you have one more color to do. You'll have to get a neon green and make a thin stripe right next to the orange. Make sure that, it's, make sure that it has a lot of coats so it'll be easier to go on. When you're done brushing away at the green stripe right next to the orange stripe, then your makeup sponge will be completed. It should look like this when done. Then take the makeup sponge and dab away at the nail. Then take a bottle of nail polish remover and dip a Q-tip into it to wipe away existing nail polish that got on your skin around your nail. After that, to seal in the neon ombre, use a fast drying clear coat. Then, once the clear coat for the neon colored ombre has dried, take a black striper and start making thin, ragged lines across the green part of the nail. You can make Y-shaped ones too. This is going to be your zebra print pattern. Keep making lots of different lines and Y-shapes so it looks more and more like a zebra print. Then, when done with the black zebra print on the green part of your nail, move on to the orange part of your nail and start making black C's. Fill in dots in the empty spaces. This will then form your cheetah print on the orange part of your nail. Seal in your design with a fast drying top coat. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this cute new nail design.